I'm going to show you some of the main things that I like about TubeBuddy and how exactly it has helped me to get more views for my channel. And once you download TubeBuddy for Google Chrome or Firefox, basically it allows you to get a lot of stats and a lot of inside information about any video that you want on YouTube. So in this case, in this video that I'm watching right now, you can see that on the right hand side, it has the video analytics for this specific video that is not mine. It shows me whether this video was actually shared on social media, and it's also showing me the tags for this specific video. So if I'm researching a topic on YouTube, if I wanna create a video that is very similar to another video on YouTube, of course I wanna know the meta analytics for this video. I wanna know exactly what type of keywords are targeting, if the video was actually shared on social media. So I wanna know all that information and TubeBuddy makes it very simple for you to see that information. So I could easily just uh, see the search rankings for this specific tags by just clicking on the button. And just by clicking on it, you can see where this video ranks on the YouTube search results. So by just clicking on that, it's showing me that this video is ranking number four for my streams of revenue. Now, if I actually wanted to create a video and I wanted to copy some of those tags, I could easily do that by just clicking on copy tags, allowing me to put that on a notepad or something. And when I upload my videos, I could use some of those tags for my own video. So once you install the extension, you can see some of the main features here on top. Like you could do bulk edits to your video, like title and description. So if I click on it, you can see that I can find and replace anything that I want on the description of my videos. So if you have a ton of videos and you need to replace a link or you need to remove something from your description, you can easily do that with TubeBuddy instead of having to just edit video by video. So this feature makes it extremely easy for you to replace anything in bulk to all the videos on your own YouTube channel. As you can see, some of the main things that you could do here, uh, bulk editing process that you can do. But I wanna show you uh, something that has helped me track how my videos are doing on YouTube. So I'm gonna click here on this video for details. And if we scroll down to this video, you can see that is showing me where this video is ranking for all the keywords that I use. And in this case, you can see that I have multiple number one results for this specific keyword that I was targeting, allowing me to get consistent views because the longer I'm sitting on the first page of YouTube for uh, whatever keywords that I wanted to target, the more views I'm gonna get at the end of the month. So if I have 200 videos that are sitting on the first page of YouTube, that means that I'm gonna get consistent views every single month. And this is why you can see uh, in my YouTube channel as my main traffic source, you can see that my views from YouTube search consistently go up every single month. And that's mainly because I apply this process of uh, creating videos for search, but also creating videos for suggested and really diving into my YouTube analytics, finding out what is working, what is not working, how can I improve some of the videos, which I'm gonna show you right now. If I click here on the TubeBuddy uh, little icon, it's gonna show me this little tool called Keyword Explorer. So if I just click on Keyword Explorer right now, I'm gonna show you a quick example of how this works. So let's say I want to create a video about making money. So I'm gonna just type make money and it's gonna give me a list of suggested videos, uh, suggested keywords that I could target with uh, my own video. So I'm gonna click on make money on YouTube here and it's gonna start looking for uh, related keywords, it's gonna tell me how much competition there is for this specific keyword and whether or not it's a good idea for me to create a video about the specific topic. So as you can see, this keyword is searched very often, but it's very bad to target because it is extremely competitive and hard to rank for, which I agree. So if you have a small YouTube channel, if you have less than 1,000 subscribers, it's not a good idea to create videos about this specific topic because you're not gonna be able to rank on the first page of YouTube for that keyword. Related keywords that are a little bit easier might be a better idea to create a video and focus the metadata on those specific keywords. So for example, let's say that I wanted to create a video uh, about make money on YouTube 2020. So if I click on make money on YouTube 2020, you can see that now we have increased our odds to fair, so now we have a better chance uh, of ranking on the first page of YouTube 
because we have chosen a keyword that doesn't have a lot of competition like the first one. So the process of actually researching a topic, keywords, uh, knowing the metadata, knowing your thumbnails, all this is crucial in order to know how a video is gonna do before you even make that video. And this is something that I take very seriously. I actually take the time to research every single keyword, every single phrase that I wanna try to rank for on YouTube. And like I said, this is just one of the many features that uh, TubeBuddy provides when you actually use their tool. They have a thumbnail generator if you wanna create your own thumbnails. They have a health report, uh, video A-B testing, which allows you to see which thumbnails are actually getting you the most views and a ton of different other features that you can implement with your own YouTube channel. Uh, they have a checklist when you're uploading a video, uh, a checklist that you can go through and see whether or not you're actually doing everything you can possibly do to make sure that your video is highly optimized for YouTube and you have the best chances of getting the most views 